welcome to my first let's play campaign ever uh, this is gonna be a let's play total war shogun 2 and uh, I'm just gonna go click on the options real quick and show you my graphic options as you can see most of it is on max but I turned off distortion effects uh, and light bloom HDR um, I'm not sure how my FPS will do when I'm frapsing so these might change I'm also going to be playing with Max Antalizing in DirectX uh, 11 when I can, when they release the full version. Um, so yeah, just thought we should get that out of the way. Uh, I'm going to be playing a long campaign on normal difficulty because I haven't played any other um, Total War games so much except for Napoleon. And uh, I'm not as good as I could be. So, um, I'm gonna be playing as Oda clan, uh, I picked Oda because I know that they start with some uh, troubling enemies nearby and that they can get rushed easily, so I think the beginning can be a challenge and uh, yeah, let's just get started. This is Sengoku Jidai, the age of the country at war. For 200 years, the Ashikaga shoguns have ruled from Kyoto. Great splendor and power were theirs. Now, the overmighty clans no longer obey. The time has come for a new warlord to become Shogun! But who will be victorious? Other lands have always provided for our people. Our enemies are many and envious. They threaten our borders and look for any weakness. Others may cover titles, but Ashigaru, common spearmen, are the bedrock of order might. All know us. The commanders of a thousand spears. It is an honor to lead such a man. Our generals are battle-scarred veterans of a righteous strength. Isha Mountain, the war god has awoken. Now is the time to defeat our enemies! All will bow to the other clan. We wait no longer. Destiny calls! We are caught in the grips of civil strife. The infighting threatening to tear our clan apart from within. Our first priority, therefore, is to quell the unrest in our midst and unify under a single banner once more. When order has been restored, we can set about building up our strength and extending our influence into the neighboring provinces. Long have we coveted Mikawa province to the east, and the recent vassalage of the local Tokugawa lord to the Imagawa has made this no less appealing. Mikawa is fertile and boasts fine war horses, vital to the production of superior cavalry. Mino is of lesser strategic importance, but the Saito should prove less bothersome to overcome, 
that whilst their daimyo is manipulative to say the least, his forces are far less capable than the combined might of the Imagawa and Tokugawa. While making war on the third front is ill-advised, neutral Ise province to the west is known for its strong religious tradition and provision of fine monks for service both on and off the battlefield. However, with power and influence will surely come the ire of Kyoto. And should the Shogun feel threatened, he will rally his subjects against us. In that event, we must be prepared to fend off all who would attack us, no matter from where that threat emerges. If the Shogun wishes to halt our expansion, let him come here and reckon with us himself. Right, so, like I said, there's gonna be a shit ton of problems in the beginning, and here we are already. Um. Cross the rebellion. Okay. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be working on my economy before I start working on the military. I think that that's uh, most important in the beginning. Uh, we have some rebels in our way. I'm gonna deal with them later. I'm just gonna fix my buildings. Although the current incumbent may preemptively attack us if we become too powerful. Hmm. I know that in the next round. Oh, shut up, shut up, shut up. In the next round, we're gonna get attacked from the south by Mikawa. And, uh, I know that because I tried this campaign for three or so rounds just to see how it is. Oh man, this is a tough decision. Well, I'm just gonna get this over with. Quick save. Alright, welcome back. Um, I just went for the easiest formation that I know of. Pretty standard formation, actually. Just having the archers in the front and the spearmen, aka Yari Ashigaris, in the back. Uh, and we'll see how this turns out. Uh, one more thing. I don't know if the audio and the video is going to turn out the way I wanted it to because this is my first uh, episode. So, I don't know if the audio is going to be too loud or too low, but I'll adjust that later on if I see any problems. And also the FPS, I'm not sure how that's going to how that's going to react to my frapsing. Just going to fast forward here. the hell are they doing? Looks like I'm gonna have to turn my entire army. That's okay. They wanna be tricky. Are they coming? Oh, they're just camping. Damn it. They're just gonna camp in the mountains. God damn it. Alright. Alright. Fine. Then so be it. Camp in those freaking mountains. Yeah, yeah. Oh no. I'm just gonna send in my commanders and hope they don't move the Yari after guns. Come on out. Uh oh, uh oh, back off, back off. Run, come on. Alright, so 
dealt with the archers at least. Looking good so far. I'm trying not to lose too much, by the way, because I know that I'm I'm gonna be I'm gonna be attacked by two clans later on. So I'm just trying to save as much as I can. Uh, and also, I know that my strategy is horrible. I, like I said before, I think I did. Um, I haven't played a lot of the melee combat Total War games. Just played Napoleon and Empire a lot, so I'm not good with uh, melee strategies yet. Anyway, oh, freak you. See if we can uh, surround them here. Looks like we're doing good so far. Just chase them off and then uh, flank them. Oh yeah, see, now we're doing it. Yes, victory. So, um... I'm gonna stop recording here and clean up the rest of the battlefield and then I'll see you again in the campaign map. Uh, welcome back. As you can see we did... I'm um, guessing pretty decent. Only lost 94, they lost 550. The only bad thing is that they still got a uh, tiny group. Uh, I was kinda hoping I could wipe them all out so that I uh, could safely return to my base. I'm just gonna auto resolve this one and hope that it doesn't mess up. Yeah. Uh, yay. More money. More money, more money, more money. Okay, so back to the building. Um, economy or warfare? Actually, I'm gonna go for roads. Yeah, roads and better castle. Also, another thing I think I can. Yes, I can. I'm just gonna increase the tax for the first. I don't know, two or three rounds because I know it's gonna be. Yeah, it's gonna be a clusterfuck in the beginning. Like I said before, they will attack me, and here they are in round one. <sighs> I wish I had an agent so look oh god damn it look this is not good or well I, I can deal with it I wish I had an agent because if I had an agent I could um, I could uh, check out some of the map and this guy is trapped that's not good Hmm, not general. So, like I said, this is my first let's play ever. So if I'm if I'm doing something wrong or if I um, if I'm just doing bad, just let me know and tell me what I can do different. I'll I'll read all the comments. Yeah, back to recruitment. I want some archers. And I might as well upgrade the farms. I think I'm gonna go attack him now. Yeah. Quick save. Oh man, he doesn't have a lot. I I'll see you guys in the ba welcome back. Um, they don't have a lot. I just thought I just thought I would. Um, do this real time because if I auto resolve, the um, AI has a tendency to not kill everybody and then just kill half of them, and they will be retreating and doing all whatever they want to do in the campaign map, which is annoying. And also, they have a general. I don't know if it's a family member or a general, but uh, either way, I want to kill him. Ooh, I think it's a daimyo. No, I don't know. But either way, I want. I just want to make sure they're dead after this match. So. That's why I'm doing a real-time uh, battle and not auto resolve despite the odds. Hmm, what are they? What are they doing? 
What's he doing over there? He's a bad general. Run, 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 run the fuck out. Oh god. I'm just gonna go all in on the general from both sides and just hope it's gonna be enough. I want it to be routing. Oh yeah, he's screwed. He's gotta be screwed. He has got to be screwed. Oh no, he's running. No, he's not. He's dead. Wow. Wow. Annihilated. <sighs> I'll see you guys in the in the campaign map. Nice. And welcome back, by the way. Uh, 40 losses and 360 kills. Unfortunately, though, they survived some of them. Damn it. General increases in rank. Who's alive? I don't know. Wow. Nice picture, bro. See, this is a hard choice, but I think I'm gonna go with that. Wasn't that hard actually? Since he's a daimyo, I'm gonna focus on his units and his bodyguards. He's more valuable than that. So I think I'm gonna conclude this part of the let's play. Uh, I'll do another one, but until then, see you next time.